got mad and I was like, I'll live the fuck ever. You can say what the fuck you want, but you come to me like, like whatever, but you're not a fucking manager of mine. I'm not hiring you to be a manager. It's like, and he got pissed with me. I think he even told me he was all sub. You know what I said to him? Don't care. I was like, that made one less view, but I still always have that one other person that like my shit. And then that was, a, that was an asshole jackass out of me. But I was like, it isn't all how he came off to me, too. And like, like I told anybody, he came off a little strong for my taste. You know, I you know sometimes you, if, if that one person come off strong, you don't want to hear that shit right then and there. You, 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 you kind of turn to an asshole. If you don't want to be turned to an asshole, but you do it anyway. That's how, how that person was. I don't remember his name or anything. It was just, it was just it was, that's how I, I just took off on him and shit. But, but how I tell people, it's not, it's not that I'm going to say, say that in that point, but it's like, this camera worked just as well for me. And it's, it's, it's still to the very day, I still say, I, for me, this will fucking work for me. And then that's what it is, man. And then also, too, back back in September last year, the problem number, I did a video back in September last year. I told everybody that I would be going on for a couple of months. And then come to find out, y'all know they'll come to find out. I ended up having a sign a couple months later in December. So, so thing was, when I had my damn sign, and I told y'all I was going to disappear, in the hospital, this is that what I told my damn girl after I had my sign, we were in the hospital. After holding my sign, I, I looked at her and I, I actually told her, I was like, I'm thinking about quitting being on YouTube. And I, 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 was, I was dead serious. I, and when I say I was dead serious, I was so much to the point where I was ready while I was in the hospital to grab my touch pad, log in, log in YouTube, and shut it the fuck down and, and that's how close I was to, to, to hold my sign and, 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 and looking at my channel channel and I was just like I don't care I was like because how I felt in the hospital holding my sign I was like everything that I wanted for my goal in life for YouTube I have accomplished I was like I was like I had at the time I was like I have a two year run at this and I was telling her I said going on three and I was like I had that view that I always wanted and I got it on a daily basis I was like, I have a couple people watching my shit here and there. I said, that's fucking perfect. And I was like, I, I said, I said, I said, technically, I looked, I looked at it like a count. I was like, I have everything that I, that I wanted and go in life for YouTube. I said, and I still to day don't have no more goals for YouTube. I'm just doing it now just for, as a hobby. But I was like, everything I want to do for YouTube, I have done it. And then and then now I looked at her, I was like, I'm, I'm ready to drop it. She was like, for what? She was like, you were doing it for a for a positive thing because, because for your near death experience. If you want to do YouTube, you should keep on doing this, this because, and this, just keep it going, just, just don't stop it, just because she was like, don't, then she looked at me and was like, you still can do YouTube, just don't overwhelm yourself with it, but I looked at her, I was like, and this is my exact words to work, when we had the conversation, and I was like, I straight told her, I was like, I, I don't know, I was like, I'm a father first, and I was like, in between being, being a father, working, take care of everything else around me, I was like, YouTube's the last on my mind, she was like, that's why you come at it when you're free. And I was like, you know what? And she's right. And she had the reason why I'm still doing YouTube. At one point, I really was, but I really, during, during that time I was in the hospital, I really was thinking about cutting this, this sucker channel go. And, I, and I, that, that was my whole mindset. I was like, I want to be a father before I do anything about fucking YouTube. And that's why when I disappeared from YouTube, I slowly took my time. And it was, it was, it was just like, and, that, and, and that's what it was. I was like, Whatever, and especially when I announced my damn son being born, and then I was like, "Well, let me, let me, let me just slowly just just try to get back into it." And a lot of times, even when he was sleeping, I was trying to record. I was, I was so pissed. I quickly like slapped the camera. I'm like, I don't even want to do this shit because it was like I'm forcing myself to do YouTube. Here's why a lot of times you, you might not see a lot of gameplay because like I don't want to force myself, and then and, and it's like that's that's the thing that I do do not want to do. And it was like that's why I was doing. I was doing like a January, I was doing February before I really got in the groove of getting back into it until back Wednesday. But I was like, at least, at least if I get in the groove back into it, you know, it made me feel better. But it was like, honestly, you have no idea how how much I really consider about shutting the channel down, man. I'm just glad, I'm just glad I didn't. I, now I, I'm thinking about it, talking to you all about it. It was just something that that, that this happened just, and I was like, whatever. And I was like, I, I, I'm not going to give up a, a, a three-year reign. Or go at the damn time, like going on three year run for nothing. I was like, I was like, I was like, I keep it going, but I was like, but I'm not gonna lie, the content probably will slow down just because I'm busy, a lot of things to do. But the reality is, man, I'm I'm happy with the way my situation on YouTube is going. A lot of people are like, well, you should have more of this, more of that. I don't care for more subscribers, I don't care for the more views, man. I'm I'm not gonna keep on 
be up here trying to promote my channel or have the crazy intro that other people's having and do this because I like I said I don't care about being being sponsored by Machinima or game trailers or ever ever who getting sponsored by these people and that's people because they ain't that damn serious. I'm just like this. I'm I'm King D and I'm gonna keep on doing what King D does, man. I'm gonna keep on being humble, being myself, and do and and, and do it how I wanna do it. If it ain't what people want want to see it done, hey, you gotta go to another fucking person. But I'm gonna keep on doing the way I wanna do it. You know what I mean? And 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 that's how it's always gonna be. I'm not I'm not gonna sit here and try to make it make it all fancy and glittery and 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 do all this. I'm gonna stick to the fucking basics, man. And 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 and, and that's what it is. I'm not gonna sit here and be. Going on my way doing all this crazy ass shit because it, it's just a hobby to me. But alright, YouTube, man. I've been talking to them for however half an hour, y'all. But that's my backstory of why I started YouTube because I got sick. And when I got sick, and, and matter of fact, if you go back, I think to March, to March 10th or March 11th of 2010, I think I even said it in that video that I was that I had surgery. That I was going because I think I told you that I was going at the time. I think by the time I think I told you I was going to get surgery, uh, or a couple of days later I was, I was going to be doing surgery. I straight up said it. So it was like, so it was like, I said it. I said it in the video so cockily, but I really didn't really tell the whole story. But now that, that's the whole story, man. But it's like three years and three years of me doing this shit and I thought I actually thought about stopping and I ain't stopping, man. So so be aware, man. King D ain't going nowhere. And it is what it is. So it's been a great, funny, fun three years, and I got plenty of years left to give in me and YouTube. Right, YouTube. It's your man King Day. Boy.